Well, meantime, during the royal's trip to the Bahamas, the Duchess of Cambridge, Princess Kate, visited school children, sending them an important message. The stop happened during their Caribbean tour, commemorating the Queen's Jubilee. Our one Caribbean News, DeAndre Hamilton reports. The world sees it, that the children and students of the Bahamas are a fortunate lot. It feels to me like you are very blessed indeed. The spectacular natural environment of the Bahamas is one of those blessings. The tone of the message of the Duchess of Cambridge was rich and warming on a chilly, soggy Friday. On cue, Minister of Education Glennis Hannah Martin reminded that it was a taste of liquid sunshine, unable to put a damper on the celebration. Strong Primary School. Woo! One of the many public primary schools throughout our archipelago. Princess Kate also joked about the muggy weather when she addressed the students. Apologies, Sabrina, it's British weather with us. <laughs> The Duchess easily became the star of this leg of a three-country Caribbean tour for the royal couple as they commemorate the Queen's 70th year on the throne. From tacking and mounting the pry of a regatta sailing sloop under overcast skies in the waters of Montague Beach, to watching Bahamian Junkanoo on Bay Street and meeting with medical professionals, stunning live Bahamian dolls and sharing so many moments with the darling children of the country despite a severe thunderstorm. The day in Nassau would not go without its protests. It also did not go without its pomp and pageantry. The princess, while attending a special service with Prince William at the Sybil Strawn Primary School, delivered well-earned congratulations to those who kept education going amidst the pandemic and a charge to the children. And I hope these difficult experiences have given you the motivation, empathy and compassion to become fully engaged citizens of tomorrow, who will become and make Bahamas the vibrant and life-affirming and soul-enriching place it is today. Thank you once again for having us today and for such a warm And that was our DeAndre Hamilton reporting there.